you guys hello hi you guys welcome back to my channel if you know my channel i'm kangsha so in this video you've read the title already you guys you guys i um received something something which is really huge which is like a huge milestone for me which happened like a month or more ago and i got this one also a while ago but that just okay i got interrupted by my dog as usual <laughs> uh after being interrupted or like after putting this off for so long i was again interrupted but anyways you guys i have the youtube play button for my 100k subscribers um so i i'll tell you a quick story okay i'll tell you why i said i postponed it i think i received this easily over 15 days ago and um i've been waiting for the right moment to open it i was like you know i'll film it or do something or something 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 and i kept postponing it like for so long even today i was like you know no i don't want to like unbox it or something like that but i was like it's been 15 days like you know suck it up because one thing i think i've realized about myself is that and not only with this i think with everything generally in life i don't know if it's a good quality or a bad quality but when i'm overwhelmed about something or i don't know how to react about something i'll postpone it so much or i'll like push it like so much until it just is not so exciting or overwhelming anymore um so the same thing when this came and i was like i wanted like when this came i was in this house only like in the new house and this got delivered to my parents house and i was like i can't believe my youtube play button has reached my house and i'm not there to take it uh and i was like i'll go that day online and take it and i did i went and i still did not have the balls to open it i don't know why it's just like now also i'm like after it subsided i see it every day i'm like okay my plate blood is there play button is there but i don't know how to process it or i don't know how to react about it so i think i kind of put it off for so long that i don't want to like open it or something so again i don't know like i do this with everything in life okay not just with the play button like if there's something which is like i am i don't know how to react or it's too overwhelming or i don't know what to say or do i just um put it put it aside for like so long that it kind of becomes boring and then i'm like but now it's not exciting anymore and anyways at this point i am happy but again i you know one more thing i don't know why i'm giving so many bashings but i think it's like you know the milestone kind of keeps gives you like so many um things all the reactions or generally i try to show of happiness are i think picked up for somewhere because we as family or i have never thought or never seen what like happiness looks like like in terms of like physical being i was we were always i think underplayed it so like internally maybe we felt happy but if you want to like externally express my happiness it's all like oh i'm like so happy you guys and all because everything like this and all also the excitement i've seen i've seen on like instagram and youtube like how people are actually happy and i try to be that but then i think like for this i actually wanted to show that happiness i'm very grateful inside but like to show it exteriorly i'm like like you know wow like all this i feel like is so fake and it's not, it's not me do i feel so sad about myself that i actually don't know how to express happiness the way i want to and you know show it like i don't know what is my form of showing external happiness like i don't know how to show i'm happy i know i mean i feel happy but i don't know how to show it like i don't know it's so sad i feel because even for not for this like even when i bought my car and moved out like i've done so many things like i recently went for my under 25 summit which again was a big deal for me like um i was like i think i was the only beauty creator there and there were like so many creators there i went for like my trip there were so many things all of these are supposed to make me feel so grateful so happy but i i just don't know why i'm not a physically happy person like i can't show my excitement in any sort of way like whatever i try to show also is like at least you know like i do it so that people actually know i am happy and i don't know if that is truly how i would react if i am happy i don't know why this turned into like um uh, you know uh, my uh, what do you call 
internal self reflection <laughs> kind of thing but i don't know i've been actually thinking about this reaction thing a lot that i don't know how to actually react happiness like i know how my anger look like i know how my sadness looks like but i really don't know what my happiness looks like i think i'm just repeating that 100 times but at this point i think i i really need to open this because it's been a while you guys and uh, i had another monumental moment um, but it's because, but, but i really think i really need to open this because it's been a while you guys and i really want to see my name on um, this play button i um, let's let's uh, open this I worked so hard like I worked so hard for this <sighs> It says a Kangsha Komarelli to 100,000 subscribers Not trying to be emotional or anything but like it is a big moment for me and it's just so it's a huge milestone you guys it's a huge huge milestone i think every like you know for a youtuber especially this is like such a thing um i just it's so i don't know what to say it, it, there's another thing called recognize your team the next one is for this little guy for a million i mean this is the silver play button you guys i can't I mean I I I think I knew I would always get a play button in some way but I, I now that I have you I, I don't know now that I have it it's still so surreal my play button it's so surreal you guys this is um, you know what is the funniest thing um it's so like i always thought for some reason in my mind i always had this that when i hit 100k i will move out okay and um, and back in like september something i hit 100k on instagram and in october is when i started house hunting okay not because i hit 100k but even that was like the time uh, on like face of my life where i actually you know got that idea and i was like trying to figure out stuff and i started honestly searching in october ending you guys and i was, and i think i told in a, uh, some other vlog that it was really difficult for me to find a home and i was on the hunt for a pet very long time okay and finally like um it's like in jan like jan ending is when i got my house when i signed the lease and you know it's like it's it's just so beautiful sometimes how things happen so i did say like generally that when i hit 100k i'll take you know a house or like move out right but um though i hit 100k on you instagram it i i like you know did not hit on youtube yet and on the day i was signing the lease for this apartment is the exact same day i hit 100k on youtube like i literally hit 100k that day and then only i got to sign the lease like it's so funny that like moreover basically in the morning we were supposed to sign the lease okay that day and in the morning i think i had like still 2 300 subscribers or something left that day but like when we actually went to sign the lease there was some issue with the printer with the office in the apartment or something and it got delayed for like 4 5 hours okay so and then i my dad and i went to like you know furniture shopping or something and by the time we came back i actually had hit 100k and then only i signed my lease so i i i don't know it's so like beautiful to see how like you can manifest few things and like um it just like 100k dono mein hona tha like instagram also had to happen 100k and youtube 100k and then only i signed my lease and i actually um moved out and like you know took my studio new space to like you know film and live and everything so this just like is so special you guys and it's just like how everything coordinates is like you know a different feeling to like recognize and know everything but oh my god my 100000 subscribers play 
button like i'm so grateful i wanted to unbox this with you guys because honestly all this is nothing without you like if i post videos and nobody is going to watch it then like <laughs> useless so like thank you for always being sweet my youtube audience audience is like my like it's just i i can't explain the relation like i love posting youtube content as well like more than instagram really um it's just something pulled i have towards my audience here and like towards the content i make here so thank you thank you so much for always loving and supporting watching what i create always you know um coming through for me like in ways you don't even know just like a like also means so much and i'm forever grateful so i just really wanted to unbox this with you guys and like share this milestone with you because this is such a special thing for me like having a hundred thousand subscribers is like it's a dream come true honestly like when i started it was like such a long mile step milestone to like you know go for and it's here and i just want to like you know take a minute and appreciate this because thank you guys thank you thank you so much uh thank you thank you thank you so much i can't even say it enough but this ke baad um there is another milestone which i achieved you will see the next part of the vlog i don't have any intro for that so i thought i'll you know continue this for that that's again a biggest milestone for me i always dreamt about the talking in such a platform and i actually got to so on to the next part of the video but like this is so special to me thank you guys thank you thank you so much you know i thought i'll be okay to open it after some time because not, i'm not overwhelmed anymore but actually the minute i saw this something happened inside me like it just like skipped to beat my heart and uh, i don't know what would have happened if, if if i opened it the day i got it even now it's like anyway continue somebody or the other call it is not like just for video bro it's been like that since yesterday <laughs> since the time i got to know about the speech also i did not have time to write the speech which i wrote last night i don't have i do not have, see again i'm getting a call <laughs> ah see i can't shoot i abhi aaj me the minute she sat in the car did you vlog i'm like i want to vlog it's my first ever by the way the premise is i'm going to give my first ever ted talk which i always dreamt of giving and then at this moment my life is so freaking packed i've been moving and i got this like two days notice i don't have time to write the speech and i'm also getting a call now i'm not able to vlog i'm not able to do anything and i have to learn my speech now my i think my ted talk is in like half an hour i don't know i jo i missed the turn because of this guy shit oh, oh again it increased this is how i feel now are you nervous I'm not nervous but I mean I guess I'll be nervous there I don't know but now I'm nervous because I don't know the speech <laughs> I don't want to miss out on some I, nice points you you'll, you'll get nice time on but at least to go through what all you wrote I hope so mm. I want to learn at least remember like key points so that I'll not forget because few nice examples I have mm. so let's see I wanted to wear a pink pants suit because like It's more powerful. I actually wanted to wear something more funky, but that tops button button also went today yo, on me, yeah, and I yo. do not have safety pins ever anywhere in my house because I'm unpacking. Shit. So I don't know where any safety pin is, and that dress tore. Through. You know what I did when I first moved in, uh. moved out. I first bought safety pins. I first bought safety I pins. I have, but I don't know where they are. It's okay. It's okay. Mm. Today morning, say carpenter is in the house. I was packing. I was doing something. Today now, <laughs> oof, everything is going to get settled. Yeah, very soon. I never thought my first ever TED talk will be. I thought like I'll always be like super prepared, like so full calm. I'll like write like some excellent speech and all. And here I am like giving it in like one go and <laughs> being in so much rush i just did not want to let go of the opportunity basically mm -hmm. like it was so last minute i was like but i don't want to let go of the chance so i just took it <sighs> this left i missed that's why we went all the way and came back oh it's just three minutes we missed this for our turn వెరీ హ్యాండ్సమ్
very professional yeah hi vlog hi vlog and we will also show the supporter <laughs> moral support coach in now all look very nice and i already know what she is going to talk yeah about. she knows my speech the first listening navya lack pe unte things wouldn't have been possible uh, yeah and now is not the time akanksha <laughs> <laughs> common sense and some uh, bit of thinking abilities you guys will make wonders okay so the parents who would be telling you what to do what not to do in a span of time you will be telling them what to do and what not to do hi guys i can see little faces and all parents um so i made a speech to give here and then after seeing raj being so funny i was like you know should i give that speech should i will everybody get you know bored you don't make it happen like nobody else will i even have that in my studio like a big sign like make it happen hey okay, guys i just got back home from the ted talk um today was madness i I've I've been doing back and forth from home and here and last night I came back um and because I had to write a speech and I had like I needed like a peace of mind and I did write it but today morning since I woke up I had so many things to get done and I also had carpentry work today only actually like I don't know I'm getting this house like I'm making this house so comfortable for me um that like I, it feels like now it's my own house only but anyways um I don't know like I think I get it for my mom like she does things so like like she's such a perfectionist and i think i get it from her only especially when like you know uh things like this like comfort come um but yeah it like today's carpentry work was very unnecessary but i still got it done i don't know my mind is all over the place i have so many things on my mind but like i did not even get a time to appreciate that i did a freaking ted talk dude like um it was in a school it was a, like a very like small scene but still like you know it's a step to like something bigger and i'm i i always as a kid dreamt to be like i think i always had this thing that i will do a ted talk i will do something to like you know be there to be like a capable person to like give a speech on like something related to ted but um yeah i just came back home i have long long days a lot of things more to do so i'm traveling entire next week so i need to get the house like sorted before that there's so much stuff dude like i i'm not even exaggerating like i really wish i was uh, because i also do not estimate like i overestimated i thought but then what i overestimated four times that like is the stuff i have even yesterday when i came i got four big uh, uh, two big like covers and one carton today when my dad came again he again got four big covers and everything the things to get from my house unending my things i have so much for one person like it's ridiculous at this point but if you look at it there's like nothing too much right but i don't know it's so like anyways um just got her back home i'm so super 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 tired i just want to like relax because i've not again had that moment to do so do so and tomorrow uh, hopefully i'll have like an off day but i have i have a shoot tomorrow i think but like i it's a basically the brand shoot so i don't i don't have the confirmation of the concept yet so depends on that i will have a shoot or else i'll just take the day um off and like finish off like organizing everything because there's so much to organize can you it took me two days to organize the entire makeup then i did skincare which got over very quickly because i literally threw away so many things because half the things were was were like expired and uh, clothes i started like i think clothes i again got rid of so many like i'm not what rid of but i'm going to thrift few i'm going to give away a few um so like um, those are there that's i think only 20% of clothes are done more 80% is left navya had come and she we and both of us had planned to sort it out but she has some work tomorrow morning and she went so tomorrow probably when she'll come again we will do it and i'll finish off clothes and then you know start living in this house properly i did like get get like other stuff like it's a very proper functional household i just have to make it functional for my work because the studio is not set up yet so anyways i spoke so much but because i'm like i'm not able to vlog properly i just wanted to give you like a premise of what is happening trying to settle down in the house so far like i've been here alone for like 2 days only i think i'm not even letting in 
in the sink the fact that i'm actually like alone alone i'm that day when i woke up alone like you must have seen my evening my parents came like now also my dad came today and i'm hoping they'll come back tomorrow again i don't know if they will or not but like i think i'm not ready to accept that i'm like you know completely living alone because i've not had the time to prep myself only um but anyways that's about it for this vlog you guys if, so this video shout out goes to srileka thank you srileka for always loving and supporting and absolutely means the world to me if you want to be part of next video shout out then all you have to do is comment below and use the hashtag aks and you can be a part i can't wait to vlog more i hope you guys are enjoying my vlogs and i've just been posting that because i've not been like you know gotten time to like sit down and film like proper youtube videos so meanwhile please enjoy the vlogs i do plan on vlogging more like letting you guys know more about me i'm super excited but yeah that's about it i'll see you guys in my next video